morning guys! Pits and your! It's a new log Sunday and while Ben and I are not hitting the streets, we are going to head to his Lola's house to have a Sinulog lunch. It's like a tradition pre-pandemic. Like it was a big party in his Lola's house. She would always, always have everything catered. There were so much lechon. There was baka and it's just fun. It's like a little reunion for everyone. But I think this year it's just very intimate. It's just immediate family. But I'm still happy because we all get to get together. And last night Ben and I even had dinner with his parents, which is nice. It's really nice that we get to be with family a lot nowadays. It's it's even crazy how we spend more time with family when we got married than we were single. Is it automatic? I don't know if you guys are the same. We spend so much time with both our families. Anyway, so <sighs> it was like a heavy morning for me. I don't want to sound like a broken record, but last night I finally got to research what endometriosis is all about and I got to talk to Tita Mia. Doc Mia my OB and her plan. I really like her plan, but I just can't believe I have it again. And it explains why I also gained so much weight over the holidays. I think I gained over 9 pounds in one month. And while I did eat during my travels, it's not like I ate so much that I would gain that much so fast. And I was talking to Vernice, who also had endo, and she said her symptoms are exactly the same. Her bloating was crazy. There was a time where she would go to medium. Sometimes she would have to order large for online shop that run really small. So. <sighs> to explains why all my other symptoms like uh, after the surgery for three months my period I didn't have dysmenorrhea anymore but on December that's when I had dysmenorrhea again and then maybe this month I'll have the same thing hopefully I won't, won't go back to how bad it was before so anyway on a brighter side I'm just happy we have a plan and I think my next update will be that already don't wanna keep talking about it because I'm gonna cry. Like I've been crying the whole morning, so <sighs> let's just let go. Let's get the BV out. Let's just attract good energy today. So anyway, let's head to lunch and I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. Going for an all-white look with white shoes and a pop of color. I haven't used this bag in a while. So I thought of just keeping it simple, but I wore this long vest to hide my building. <laughs> I knew this like fiber old vest would come in handy. So let's go. Pits in your guys. Okay guys, so we just finished Sinulog lunch and we're now heading to Streetscape to buy supplies. Things that are needed at home before we leave for Manila tomorrow. So, where's the Bordo? We're gonna take Bordo out. It's Bordo's day out. Bye, Bards! Wow, naman! Everyone has a treat! Chewy! Hi, baby! Are you happy? Chewy! We are home, guys. So, I am just gonna be spending the whole afternoon packing for a two-week trip. So, one week, we're gonna be spending it in Manila. And then, the other week, we're gonna go back to Dubai! But for now, it's strange. arrived here in Manila and I'm off to a meeting for Bernice's bachelorette so I'm actually planning a surprise for her and I'm gonna be meeting Gideon, I'm gonna be meeting Ongte at the char of Night Sprint and I'm also gonna be meeting the one from Discovery Primea and I'm so excited to plan it with them! Let's go! Hello at the
Good morning guys! So, it is second day in Manila and Ben and I are heading to BGC today because we're gonna have a lunch date and Ben will have a haircut in the Zero Story One. You're an opa na, babe! So anyway, after that we're going to the mall and of course I'm gonna take you guys with me. Hello guys, so it is a, I think it's my third day in Manila and my parents decided that we're going to have a little family dinner since we're going to be complete. So we're going to have some steaks tonight and I think it was just what we did today. So I was just at home, it was nice to just finally stay home for one whole day and now we're heading out to have dinner. Someone's saying hi. Someone say hi! We're in school! Say hi to my vlog! You haven't appeared in my vlog this year. Hello. Are you so sleepy? Hi, boys. <laughs> hi, Sobi. Are you gonna have your dinner? That's why you're in your cage. Come here! Go, go, go! Sobi! is a baby. Yay! Say hi naman to my vlog. Cabra lover. Okay. Hi, babe. Hi. Who does that? Me, I do that. Good morning, guys! So it is 11 in the morning, and we are heading to Patricia Santos's atelier because I'll be meeting her for my dress for Vernice's wedding. So it's the first time I'm going to be wearing her, and I've been looking for the perfect excuse ever since Vernice and I discovered her designs. And finally, Vernice's wedding is the best time to wear her. And we are going to check out furniture for a new house. Ben and I and we're going to head to Modern Brands showroom which is really exciting because the closet that I really want, my dream closet, is there. Like I'm going to see a sample, that's what they told me and I'm just really excited. Today is a very exciting day. After it's all about me, it's gonna be all about Ben because we are going on a movie date and we're going to be watching Avatar. For three hours, guys. I don't know how I'm gonna survive. I made sure to bring a power bank. It's burn time because it's actually our ninth anniversary of meeting today. So Ben and I have known each other for nine whole years. Can you believe that? So anyway, we're very near. We're in BGC, and we'll see you in the atelier. Did we getting married again? Yeah, th third time. <laughs> then there's gonna be a fourth next year. I think for a long time we're gonna yeah, every, every year. year. So I just finished my meeting with Pat Santos. It's so nice to finally like see her again after years. I think I'm not sure if I saw her during the pandemic, but anyway, so the dress is so nice. I'm gonna ask for a sketch from her team so that I can flash it here. So Vernice helped me choose a design for that one and she did an amazing job editing the inspiration and I really can't wait to wear her for the first time and now we're on our way to Modern Brand showroom so they have a newly built showroom in Bagtikan in 
Makati and it's about 18 minutes away from BGC so I'm excited because there's actually a kitchen there that's worth I think 17 million pesos can you imagine that so we're gonna see that in person for the very first time and let's go We're done looking at the closet upstairs. We're going to be looking at kitchen modular designs because Ben and I will decide what kitchen or what additions we can put in the kitchen that we're going to have in our new home. And then after that, we're going to be looking at the furnitures that we can buy as well. So the bed that you guys saw earlier, that's actually the exact design for the bed that we're going to buy. And then it's nice because there's storage under where after living in a condo for almost three years or two years, I know how important storage is. And it's nice that there's an extra storage under there and it easily put it up and easily pull it down. So there, okay, let's go and see the kitchens. viewing the modern brand showroom so i think i was so excited maybe more excited to move in our new house i think because i finally got a visual of how my closet will look like so the closet that i showed you guys that is my closet will be almost double the size of that oh, yeah, oh. this boy wow babe you're, it's the best push gift because but then i believe we're gonna be pregnant by the time we move in so it's gonna be the Before. best push gift ever with that closet so it's so nice because the reason why we went with modern brands is for my closet is because ben and i plan to live in this house forever so we really wanted to for invest for a long time you really wanted to invest in a forever closet investing in a brand like modern brands is gonna be the best decision ever because it's gonna last me for a very very long time and it will still look brand new even if 10 20 years has passed by because i think that's very important that's why i even chose colors that are classic like it's not like too trendy even the design of my closet won't be something the design will last for only just a few years but i really really am so happy and excited that i'm finally gonna get my dream closet guys so if you know me if you've been following me for the last 12 years you would know that it's really like one of my life goals to have a closet as beautiful as the one i'm going to have so if you guys want to visit the modern brand showroom as well you guys can head to Makati it's very very near the center and it's so easy like it took us about 18 minutes to get from BGC so there it's very complete they will show you everything that they have to offer all the pullouts all the drawers all the features that they have and there I can't wait to plan so it's about six months from now till my closet is complete so that's the first step to choose all the little details that I'm gonna have in that closet so Anyway, we're gonna go to our movie date now, but first we're gonna eat and then a movie date. So, let's go! Cayenne pepper powder. Oh my god. It's a lit kicker. Huh? 